Hi friends, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we have to discuss about one of the most important and commonly asked question in academic point of view and campus interviews point of view in database management system is difference between third normal form and BCNF. First of all, we already know that there are six types of normal forms available. First normal form, second normal form, third normal form, BCNF, fourth normal form and fifth normal form. Now, we have to find out what are the main differences between 3NF and BCNF. 3NF stands for third normal form. BCNF stands for Boise Card Normal Form. Now we can go for the first point. A relation R is said to be in third normal form if and only if it satisfies two conditions. First one is a relation should be in second normal form. Second point is it does not contain any transitive dependencies. Whenever we are satisfying these two conditions, we can say that a relation R is said to be in third normal form. What is transitive functional dependency? We can take any functional dependency P conditional Q where P is a primary key or a super key and Q should be the part of the primary key. Okay. Next, whereas in the case of BCNF, a relation R is said to be in Boise card normal form if and only if it satisfies two conditions. First one is a relation R should be in third normal form. Second one is for a functional dependency P conditional Q where P is a super key. Whenever these two conditions are satisfied by any relation, we can say that that relation is said to be in Boise card normal form. Okay. Next. Second point. The redundancy is high in 3NF. Whereas in the case of BCNF, the redundancy is comparatively low in BCNF. Okay. So redundancy is nothing but same information is replicated at more than one place. Okay, that is called as a redundancy. Redundancy is very high in third normal form, whereas in the case of BCNF, the redundancy is comparatively low in BCNF. Next one is lossless decomposition can be achieved in 3NF. We already know that there are two types of decompositions. First one is lossless decomposition. Second one is lossy decomposition. Decomposition is nothing but dividing the relation into two or more number of relations. At that time, the information that our loss is very less, then we can say that it is a lossless decomposition. When we are losing more information, when we are decomposing the relation into several number of relations, then it can be called as lossy decomposition. Okay, here lossless decomposition can be achieved in 3NF. Here, lossless decomposition is very harder to achieve in BCNF. 
Next point in 3NF focuses only on primary key. Okay, we already know that primary key by using that key we can uniquely identify each and every attribute of a relation. We can achieve all the attributes of a relation by using that key. That key is called as primary key. Okay. In 3NF, we focus only on primary key, but in the case of BCNF, we focus only on candidate key. Okay. Candidate key is also a primary key. Okay. Next one. 3NF is not stricter than BCNF. Okay. Because of high redundancy in 3NF, we can say that 3NF is not stricter than BCNF. Whereas in the case of BCNF, BCNF is more strict than 3NF. Next one is, it is comparatively easier to achieve. So, we can achieve 3NF, it is very easy, but we are achieving BCNF, it is more difficult. Because to achieve the BCNF, the relation should satisfy first normal form, second normal form, third normal form. In addition to that, every attribute on the right, left hand side of functional dependency should be a super key. That condition we have to satisfy in BCNF. So, because of that reason, it is very difficult to achieve. Okay. Next point is to get the 3NF, all the functional dependencies should be in first normal form and second normal form. In the first normal form, every row contains atomic value. In the second normal form, it does not contain any partial functional dependency. Whenever all the functional dependencies should be in first normal form and a second normal form, then the relation is said to be in 3NF. Next one. In the case of BCNF, all the functional dependencies in the given relation should be in first normal form, second normal form and third normal form. Third normal form does not contain any transitive dependencies. Second normal form does not contain any partial functional dependencies and the first normal form does not contain any multiple values for a particular attribute. Whenever a relation R satisfies first normal form, second normal form and third normal form, it should satisfy the BCNF also. Okay. To get the relation should be in BCNF, it should satisfy first normal form, second normal form and third normal form. Next point. 3NF can be obtained without sacrificing all the dependencies. Okay. So, to get the 3NF, we cannot sacrifice all the functional dependencies. Okay. Whereas, in the case of BCNF, dependencies may not preserve in BCNF. Next one is, we can say that every, every 3NF is not in BCNF. Every 3NF is not an BCNF. Whereas, in the case of BCNF, every BCNF is in 3NF. Every BCNF is a 3NF. Every 3NF is not a BCNF. Okay. So, normalization is a technique that is used for removing the redundancy. To remove the redundancy, the given relation R can be 
divided into more number of subrelations only to remove the redundancy we are dividing the relation into two or more relations after dividing the relation into two or more relations next we have to satisfy first normal form second normal form third normal form so in the case of first normal form okay every attribute contains a single atomic value that means we are observing every row and every column it contains a single value it does not contain multiple values okay in the case of second normal form it does not contain any partial functional dependency okay non key attribute of a functional dependency is not dependent on the part of the primary key whenever it does not contain partial functional dependency it should be satisfies the second normal form okay next one 3 and f it does not contain any transitive dependency in the case of transitive dependency left hand side variable should be a candidate key or a super key okay whenever it satisfies a functional dependency does not contain any transitive dependencies the relation r is said to be in 3 and f okay so these are the main differences between third normal form and boise chord normal form okay thank you if you really like this session please forward this session to your friends and classmates please subscribe my youtube channel dibela srinivasara after subscribing my youtube channel click on the bell icon to get the future updates in my youtube channel if you really like this video please click on the like button if you have any if you have any doubts please put your doubts in the comment section i will clarify your doubts thank you thank you one and all for watching this video